the recording then we can Namaste everyone thank you for joining in this video and this is a huge this is going to be a huge surprise for all of you we have with us our my favorite astrologer bhavani anna bhavani anandanda namaste anna thank you for gracing namaste, this namaste. this presentation and today uh, bhavani anna has decided to speak about his favorite topic on mundane astrology so over to you anna it's all yours ah so today what i am going to do is i am going to give a small brief in mundane astrology it has been right. my favorite topic for many decades and all for right. past two decades i am associated with astrology uh, so as of now what is the significance of this subject because agar koi baat karte hain to us baat se jo listen karta hai usko koi fayda hona chahiye correct right ki samay ye ek cheez hai time is such a thing that if at all you waste it you cannot repay them the time they had lost even if you give it really enough rupee right 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 if this moment if you like give it if i want to return you i cannot do that even if i give it really enough rupee to you so ye samay se unko koi fayda hona chahiye jo aadha ghante hum baat kar rahe hain right ji 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 they should have some sort of benefit what is the reason that why we should pursue astrology first the question goes there it is said that three things are directly related and give immediately benefit in an human life one is said to be yoga yoga siddha vritti nirodha so yoga is said to give immediate benefit hum agar walking karte hain to yo bhi yoga hota hai walking is related to chani gives some sort of immediate benefit then the other thing is aushadha that is to say ayurveda correct right. jo peda hota hai the jo plants hote hain even in this plants it is said that the time of plucking the plant or herb is important to give good results aajkal to bahut sare log jab bolte hain hum bhi tripla kaate hain hum bhi ashwagandha kaate hain why don't we derive the benefits right so said each plant grown at a particular place taken at a particular time when the breathing capacity is optimum gives the maximum results it is called right. as pancha pakshi shastra correct right ye bolte right. hain tamil nadu mein वाराही कारणम वाला जो वाराही मंत्र का उपासना करता है जो काली मंत्र का उपासना करता है उससे झगड़ा मत करना पंच पक्षी तरीके को लाते ये क्या होता है पंच पक्षी जो हमारा ये टाइम होता है इसे फाइव में डिवाइड करते हैं ये एक पर्सन का एक क्वालिटी होता है वन इज क्रो वन इज पैरो वन इज आउल तो द ब्रीथिंग डिफर्स अकॉर्डिंग टू देर Nam akshara, nakshatra, and also their physical ladder. So they say that if at all somebody knows the pancha art of pancha pakshi, usse bhi jagda mat karna. So jo khali mata ka upasana karta hai, usse bhi jagda mat karna. Jo pancha pakshi shastra ka knowledge karta hai, jo time ka knowledge rakta hai, usse bhi jagda mat karna. Isa ek problem hai Tamil Nadu. Jee. Ye kya hai? Kyunki agar hume ye time ka knowledge aa gaya. तो हम क्या करेंगे डिसीजन वाइजली ले लेंगे करेक्ट इफ यू नो द टाइम यू विल स्टार्ट टेकिंग डिसीजन वाइजली फॉर एग्जांपल इफ यू नो द कैपेबिलिटी ऑफ द एंड्रॉइड सेल फोन इन योर हैंड इफ यू नो इट इज ओनली 256 जीबी यू विल ट्राई टू यूटिलाइज द स्पेस वाइजली करेक्ट यू विल नॉट यूज इट लाइक द आईफोन सो द फर्स्ट रीजन व्हाई आई शुड नो एस्ट्रोलॉजी इज ऑल द 800 बिलियन पीपल आर नॉट द सेम ईच वन हैज एन इंडिविजुअल कैपेबिलिटी each one has an individual limitation so why should i learn astrology i should learn astrology to know, know what is my capability and what is my limitation so that i can take decisions wisely correct right agar mujhe gaadi chalna nahi aata hai to mujhe gaadi mat karna hai i should not drive a car but i should know what is my strength you call it as a strength weakness opportunity correct in mba right so what analysis so astrology helps in doing a swot analysis of yourself because you know your atma karaka which is your stronghold you know your nyati karaka which is your weakness point and you try to balance between this and find an optimal result in your life right the next thing is why i should know the mundane astrology because why i should know your mundane astrology agar hum ek plane mein chal rahe hain to if at all we are driving in a plane the pilot horoscope will determine the horoscope of all those who are traveling in it similarly 
if three are staying in a place, we should first understand note that what is the nakshatra, what is the zodiac sign of the place we are staying. Correct. For example, somebody is very successful in one part of city, but if he or she moves to the other part of city, they make a failure. And right. somebody from there, you call it as geo location or something in astrology, but astrocartography. Uh, astrocartography. Astro cartography that by changing places you change your fate, correct? We have seen in history that people with a very bad marks have fallen from their grace in kingdom at some places. And when astrologer said, Agar ap jayahan, jagada karenge to ap har lenge, magar he had chosen the right place to fight and he became an emperor. There is a history regarding that. First thing is, we should know what might happen. As I say, it's all your probability. It's, and probability has a chance of happening or not. Not happening. happening. That is not a problem. So, what is Ashwini Nakshatra, we are seeing that the great planet called Jupiter is entering. Right? And Jupiter, we are saying Jupiter. Brahaspati. Because when we compare the size of Jupiter with that of our ear, it is very huge. Right? right. And the movement of Jupiter and the Saturn, when they come after 60 years to an eclipse in some point, you determine that 60 years, correct? The very right. year. Right. And nowadays, what the NASA and all those they say, this determines the climatic change every year, right? And we have composed the names, poems, and everything long, long ago by Sage Parasa. So, what is going to happen now, or what is the probability that we might see? Now we are seeing it is a conjunction of Jupiter and Rahu along with few other planets. Okay, Sun and Rahu. So there was a similar conjunction of Guru and Rahu in 2016-17, if I remember, at Leo, right? right? But that didn't cause a big impact. How it might cause a more bigger impact now and what can be the impact and how we can stay safe, right? There are three things. Because when we offer, when we say give a diagnosis, we should also give a medication, correct? Right. So the first thing is now group has come there, Rahu Dua Hota hai, Jupiter knowledge hota hai. And when this Jupiter and Rahu is going to get conjunct, we are driven by artificial intelligence, correct? We are driven by artificial intelligence. We see some instances where elephants get into trouble because elephants are Jupiter, correct? Tamil Nadu may be a parte hai ki koi places may elephants go, they have got into some problems. And other thing is Jupiter is yellow in color. In fact, it is said yellow color this year, unless you have a Jupiter Mahadasha, some people suggest don't wear yellow things. Okay, until October. Some people have that opinion. But I wear it since I have a Jupiter Mahadasha. So that's I am wearing it. And another thing is Jupiter is associated with gold. Few people right. say gold is associated with sun. Okay. But I personally have felt when Jupiter is getting conjunct with Rahu or a snake planet in a nakshatra of Rahu or Ketu and is aspected by a malefic planet, it is going to cause some increase in the price of gold until October 1st. Okay. If there has to be an increase in the price of gold, it means the world economy, there has to be a fall in the price of some global currency. Correct? Jupiter is associated with something that is big. And the right. biggest economy or the biggest country aajkal to kya hota hai? America hota hai. Right? Yeah. So somewhere down the line, I feel that Vidyan is also in Aries, right? Right. In Tamil astrology, we believe that karma is at three points. One is at the star of Aswini. Aswini kya hota hai? Amara head hota hai, brain hota hai. Correct? Right. So, karma ko hum ye Tamil mein bolte hai, Saivini. Saivini ko kya bolte hai? I jo. So, you people in North India say, kisi ne kisi par, they have put some, this thing. Uh, okay. But in Tamil, what they believe now, if some prayog has to happen and you have to be affected by that, in previous birth, you should have done something for the A, B, or C, correct? Otherwise, yes. it would not take place. Yes, in yes, previous yes. birth, 
it is a karma you have created that he is settling his course now now you have to deal out the karma it's called a sevini or something like that so what they say is when at and the star of ashwini your planets get conjunct it is the karma that you personally have created that star of ashwini the other star they say at mahanakshatra which is the nakshatra of pitru pitru they say that it is an ancestor that you can identify or relate with you that is to say within 100 years 150 years okay there is another concept also in tamil astrology they say that if two stars are placed within the third star because the third star we say it na it is not second is sampattara third is not so great and all so if it is a relationship between there they say it denotes your karma some sort of karma correct for some people your horoscope is extremely good and for some people it is not so good even if they decide the time of birth correct right 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 many people have an opinion that they decide the time of birth but in mm. fact it is not like that it is even the time of birth which they choose is also pre decided correct i have seen in many charts they would have consulted an astrologer and the astrologer would have given a time but ultimately after 5 or 10 years when they checked the horoscope there would have been some flaw which would have been unnoticed by the astrologer you would have been an experienced astrologer it means that the astrologer is not wrong but it means the karma of the native was more strong than the knowledge of the astrologer so that it had placed a blanket on the eyes of the astrologer in right. fact to say the truth unless the native has some good karma even the greatest of the greatest astrologer cannot save a person First, right 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 second thing we will go what we say mahanakshatra if there is a star placed in mahanakshatra we can see for example if there is a moon in mahanakshatra we can say safely in his maternal side some karma is pending there we yes. used to say like that for example saturn is in mahanakshatra for myself i have a saturn in mahanakshatra saturn plus ketu is equal to sanyasi yoga correct it gives some sort of things in when saturn is in mahanakshatra then the, you can say that my aunt had some problems because saturn denotes some aunty mother's younger uh, this thing she had some problem then we have something called as the moola nakshatra moola nakshatra is nirti devati the deva nirti devi southwest direction it denotes a karma that is that belongs to 500000 years they say it's a de- devata dosha that is to say if some planet is placed in the moola nakshatra moola means the root root means at the beginning of the root itself some problem was there in existence since you have got your skin your nose eyes your all your genetic thing from your ancestors you have to repay that in 2019 2020 we had at the end of november we had a conjunction of jupiter k2 and all those things at the nakshatra of moola nearby ketu was to restrict so what it did mitana was gemini was the distinct communication travel etc so it had restricted the seventh house right but now we have a conjunction of jupiter and rahu at ashwini the head the mesha so seventh house is tula correct tula pratula is south china also tula rashi to south china bhi hota hai correct so there can be an impact in taiwan correct there can be an impact in taiwan the relationship of china towards usa might become little bit messy one thing okay and another thing is we have to get into the horoscope of the kings these days we don't have kings we have the presidents we presidents. have the prime year to gone is scorpio right Okay. and even our honorable prime minister is scorpio right many great leaders have come from scorpio mm. right mm. because scorpio is a sign that is very secretive correct to achieve something people have to be secretive scorpio is the sign of our excretory organs correct it reproduces also and in scorpio moon debilitates when your moon debilitates it means you are mercury is getting stronger your practical approach is becoming very stronger right? right so scorpio people i will say that since in their 12th house k2 is going over there and in the 6th house there is some conflict correct 
and turkey is known by the name of the capital of turkey is ankara correct ankara ankara yes. means angakara correct so it denotes something towards mars correct for example baghdad this bagadatta the 10th capricorn correct you right aditya baga aditya so that is called as bagadatta so somewhere down the line i believe in turkey there can be a political change or something and to say turkey is the thin line between asia and europe and this side usa right it is the main deciding factor there so there can be a power politics or something which can have an impact in russia because we have to take into consideration the chart of putin and also the chart of biden who are the biggest pilots of the world correct they run the biggest uh, for all we have to decide about the fate of a vessel or a plane flight we have to know the chart of the pilot correct Right. so what is going to i feel that putin in coming days might feel more pressure in his job and at some point of time he has to be very very careful because okay. if at all that happens petroleum prices might take a root shock because saturn is going to get a retro in venista and from there saturn will get in dragon into satar vishaka saturn is going to have its third aspect and the third aspect of saturn is considered to be not so great compared to the 10th aspect and the 10th aspect for career it is good but okay. saturn gets debilitated at the third house from its mula tripona correct okay. for example i'll tell you mars it gets debilitated in karkata and when mars has the fourth aspect it's more powerful i have seen in experience that when mars is having the fourth aspect it creates a strong sort of stambana correct so mesha bidden bidden is ashwini correct and there it is rahu there are two types of snakes because i live in a forest area i know there is two types of snakes get to the harmless snake at first it troubles you but you can tame easily rahu doesn't troubles first first it okay. lives freely at the okay. end when it is going to move it will hit that okay. is the characteristic of rahu okay. rahu will never trouble when in the beginning ketu mm. will trouble in the beginning but at the end he will go in a smart peaceful way so what i assume is the whole entire world has to be in prayers until october because as i said artificial intelligence etc is very good i don't mm. oppose technology because i use technology like anything but the thing is global economy might go in for a toss most probably by october those who do trading in shares have to be extremely careful because i expect a great depression like 1929 when everything went for a downturn i think dollar is going to face more trouble since it's a global currency and as of now i don't see a great thing in cryptos also because i think there is going to be a technological change even if china rises as a global power it should be cautious to retain itself because i think it cannot be in a longer run. there is something that usa was able to retain its global leader status for a century correct after right. 1915 after the second world war they had risen up and until now they have tried to retain it so it's a declining power in my opinion they are trying to retain it even mm. if china rises i know china is making a considerable progress this days but they have to be cautious so as to retain their growth as i feel the next 2030 31 when the sunny rahu combination is is going to happen mm. rohini nakshatra sunny it is going to be something tougher there because it was the thing that dasharatha had written long ago right now yes, sunny yes. maharaj he is in uh, our house of aquarius then slowly he will move there then sunny and rahu will meet out there from there 
when shani maharaj is going to enter into the nakshatra of rohini it is going to be a time of change i believe new leaders will come something everybody has to adapt themselves many people from now i will say respect food because many people don't respect food correct yes many people saw what happened in lanka right there was an economic crisis but thankfully we respect our food we pray for to offer all right 2024 the economic crisis can widen around the globe frankly okay. speaking because sunny and rahu are going to meet they are going to meet and pisces is always has its a mystery it's a mystery because it's a sign of moksha correct 12th house moksha 12th house is c correct right so sunny and rahu is going to meet over there i think global wars in a larger scale are yet to start and we are reaching some point on that something is going to flare up somewhere down the line before october so what we can do from our side all of us have to respect the food correct moon the sustainment it gives us daily whenever we have to take at least a cup of food we have to thank all our uh, those who provide for us because i there are attitude is a great attitude and hope everything will be fine right uh, right. Yes. right just a few questions anna uh, what do yeah. you predict for india in the upcoming year since we are speaking about mandal astrology india goes i think india will have a great 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 leader in future even we know our leaders are great and all but there is going to be somebody who is very great until now they may have not uh, expected somebody great in future will come and revive this economy uh, something good is going to happen but before something go good is going to happen whenever something good is going to happen yes, before yeah. that small exams come correct right right bhi koi acha cheez aata hai jeevan mein uske pehle to thoda bahut sankat bhi aata hai correct ji jab sankat aata hai when we are in the comfort zone we are not going to improve ourselves right So yes then we have some exams that might be an economical exam also i say that global economy might go for a toss and global mm-hmm. economy necessarily does include india all right and many people have a opinion that as far as uh, mundane astrology of course many people say calculate it by uh, this karkata rasi disrupt like and all those things but as per parashara the whole indian subcontinent will come in makar rashi time right right they right. has to be to get chance but by god's grace as i said india we are spiritual nation right everybody is praying 24 by 7 so yes deeply grounded in spirituality and everybody is praying to god as per their faith everybody is praying to god 24 by 7 i know that it's a spiritually oriented nation right so thankfully by god's grace we will have some great leader because as i said in 2030 31 that shani in rohini nakshatra there can be some exams but india will come out of it it will be glorious there will all that is you are you are on mute anna you are on mute yeah. i believe i hear my voice am i audible yes 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 you are and i believe in future there might be some wars but as said india is a spiritual com- com- nation and will come out victoriously and there might be two superpowers out of asia and india will be one of them okay okay because okay. until now the superpower status was given to european yes. nations and that of us right yes for first time in the century we will see that there are two nations and the super power status will come to asia and india will be one among okay. another thing most probably is that i'll just leave it for choice but there will be two super powers which is going to control rather than control guide the whole world because as i said india is a spiritual nation it will not control anything it will just help it will just be guide. act as a facilitator 
it will try to help and right. maintain the global harmony and peace right right so so and just two questions before we let you go then uh since you said about artificial intelligence and jupiter and rahu coming together mm -hmm. does indicate artificial intelligence so as i see it there could be you know companies or organizations in investing more in technology than on people do you think artificial intelligence will evolve enough to you know to threaten the human jobs or do you do you see humans being replaced by technology because jupiter of course is jiva karaka i see that many might lose jobs and all but i don't want to frighten honestly okay. speaking i said 2024 where <laughs> many people will realize the importance of food correct yes yes that's yes. why because as i said when jupiter and rahu is getting conjunct it might lead to a reduction in jobs and that might many people survive on emis and all correct jupiter and rahu indicates credit cards also loans also correct your expenses are going to increase right ye to jeeva tatva hota hai guru so whatever he is associated with he is going to multiply right k2 restricts rahu is going to expand the exponentially expand. Yes. And so when it is going to expand exponentially. Right. And especially in the nakshatra, in the Rasi of Mesha, correct? Mesha is Mars. Mars gets exalted at the 10th house where it is the house of work, correct? Karmastan par exalt ko jata hai. Or fourth house of rest par he gets debilitated, correct? Mars likes to work. Work, yes. And Mars doesn't like to take rest. So he gets debilitated there. And sun, the authority gets exalted there at uh, this thing. Sun is calcium, sun is bone, sun is job, sun is authority comes through job and white color jobs, right? And the Saturn is going to aspect it, correct? Isiliya hum gote hai ki jab shani or bu ka koi yukti nahi to something happens with some, in Tamil we used to call it as Brahmahati Dota, correct? When Jupiter and Saturn tangent, there used to be trouble of stomach, correct? When Jupiter and Saturn is conjunct, there used to be a delay in babies, correct? Right. When Jupiter and Saturn is going to conjunct, it is also said that they will get wealthier at their, when their grandchildren come. That means they are not going to be wealthy, their grandchildren will be wealthy, correct? It is a way of positively saying things. So what is going to happen? Jupiter is, for example, I'll say Saturn and Jupiter are the two sides of points, correct? Smooth right. takes two and a half days to cross. And the Saturn, old man takes two and a half years, ah. correct? Days and years. And what happens? Sun takes one, one year. month to cross, but this Jupiter takes one year. One year. So yeah. Jupiter is the highest expression of Sun, correct? And Saturn what is... is going to learn? Shani, ka, Shani is getting powerful these days, correct? Hmm. Shani is going to get... The only time he is going to get a little bit problematic is when he is going to get this retrograde. And that is going to be three or four months. Then he is going to have his third aspect. Rahu is there. But even the only beneficial side of Jupiter plus Rahu is technology will improve. But the negative side is Rahu and Saturn slows down personal life. Because it's a lot of Vayu Tattva, correct? Mm. Rahu ka Vayu Tattva ho jata hai. Mother, Saturn jab Rahu ko dekhta hai, to agar diseases a jata hai, to bhi control mein rahe leta hai. It can be controlled to some extent. Right. The negative part the thing is Sir Hota hai, correct? Tapa Sir Pa Dhyan Rakna Chahi hai. Uttu Kal Purushka Pahla House chahi hai, right? Jee. So it is going to be. And now this Mars is going to get debilitated, correct? When right. Mars gets debilitated, it doesn't mean that he will not have any power. Woh Nietzsche Kaam Karega, correct? Jee, jee. Right? The commander will do, the soldier will do a job that is not worthy for his status, correct? Immorality, immorality. Correct. Now, there is a war there. Yes, yes. So, what will happen? What will happen when the Lord has one aspect of this house, the Lord has one aspect of this house, the Lord has one aspect of this house, it will have it, correct? Shani, Mars and Shani, they never go together, right? And then he will enter Leo, Shani will have the seventh aspect also, and this guy will have that. Correct? Right. 
दृष्टि मार्स क्या होता है इट्स आवर ब्लड करेक्ट सैटर्न क्या होता है इट्स आवर सॉर्ट ऑफ प्रॉब्लम सैटर्न प्लस मार्स इन अ मैन स्टार सम प्रॉब्लम इन इट्स जॉब ओके दे विल यू से अदर देन यू कीप अ पीस ऑफ मैग्नेट इन योर शर्ट इट डस वर्क्स पीस ऑफ व्हाट पीस ऑफ व्हाट अन्ना व्हाट मैन पीस ऑफ व्हाट व्हाट डिड यू से मैग्नेट मा मैग्नेट मैग्नेट ओके 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 दैट इज अ रेमेडी ओके ये बोलते हैं ना ये सैटर्न को वीक हो जाता है राइट जी जी Yes, I mean. So the thing is, you have to. I mean, you see, can you see me? Yes, yes, yes. You are visible, Anna. What happens is Saturn plus Mars. I mean, the lady is Saturn. Sun plus Mars. They will say if at all she has Sun plus Mars, they will say in marriage and all, na. Because the body is what it is. It will be the more heated, right? Sun or Mars. And when Jupiter, Sun, and Mars are there, or I have seen that when Jupiter, uh, Sun, and Mercury are there, they have some stress. Right? Right. 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 Oil and all, they get into skin problems because mercury is related to the skin, and that. Right, right. Right. So what happens is now Saturn is aspecting everybody, right? Like, and as I said, the aspect of third aspect of Saturn is more powerful than the seventh and tenth aspect. Why? Because the third aspect is what happens. The third virious stand is what happens. Correct. And yeah. then you will get that area. When somebody hits you, you will become strong. Correct? Even if you stick to it, you just hit mm. something. Na. So Saturn, what does he do? He will cause you pain so that you get out of your comfort zone. You learn something, right? Yeah, yeah. That is the problem over there. That's why we say that he is doing it. Correct? Shani and Chandrama. Because Chandra, what does he do? Charity, Indra, Indriya. Shani, what does he do? We will try to control the Chandra. Saturn is. Uh, अर्जेंटीनाटिंग Uh, for example you are watching football correct you cannot say whether you are doing good or right you are wasting your time right <laughs> yes something like that so saturn this time will cause some impact but it might be towards the end of october and okay. most probably it might be in some trading and all because tula rashi seventh rashi correct j all the other rashis are some animal correct मेष राशि तो क्या होता है एक बुट होता है सेकंड इज अ बुल थर्ड इज टू बट सेवेंथ राशि इट्स अ वेइंग स्केल करेक्ट व्हाई वी गिव द वेइंग स्केल सेवेंथ राशि इज द कलस्टर स्थान करेक्ट फॉर अ पर्सन राइट हस्बैंड एंड वाइफ इक्वली यू शुड ट्रीट देन मैरिज वुड बी सक्सेसफुल दैट इज द वेइंग स्केल राइट सो व्हाट हैपेंस इन एनी रिलेशनशिप ट्रीट इक्वल रिलेशनशिप विल सरवाइव करेक्ट टू One, four, seven, ten is more important, right? One is you yourself. Four is the first vehicle, first house, your mom, correct? Fourth house and seventh house, fourth from fourth, correct? Right. And from seven, the tenth house, profession. Tenth from tenth is seventh, correct? Yes. Mm-hmm. So, what will happen? The seventh house of Tula from Kerala Purusha is going to get affected, correct? If the economy is affected, everything is going to stagnate. Right. That is why they say the Trikonas and Kendras are Mahalakshmi and Mahavishnu. Correct. Right. If there is a wealth, there will be somebody to protect it. If there right. is somebody to protect, there will be wealth. Both right. coexist. Correct. Right. And for right. everything, 
लगना इज इम्पोर्टेंट करेक्ट हमें कोई चीज पर लगना चाहिए लग्न चाहिए मगर ये तो लग्न पर हो रहा है करेक्ट इज टू से इन टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन सेवनटीन वेन दे से जुपिटर राहु कंजंक्शन टू प्लेस इट टू प्लेस एट द नक्षत्र महा और राशि ऑफ लियो यहाँ भी हीट ही है वहां भी हीट ही पुत्री फायरी सेंस करेक्ट मेष का फायर डिफरेंट है लियो का फायर डिफरेंट है धनु राशि का फायर डिफरेंट है कर्कट राशि भी पानी है वृक्षक राशि भी पानी है मीन राशि भी पानी है तीनों पानी में डिफरेंस है एक तो मॉल पानी है एक तो द रिवर है तीसरा समुन्दर है करेक्ट और ये भी देखने को पड़ता है जो कर्कट राशि के होते हैं वृक्षक राशि के होते हैं और मीन राशि के होते हैं वो पानी का राशि है ना जब वो रोते तो आई हैव नोटिस वो दे विल हैव दो आंसू आ जाएगा जब वो टीवी सीरियल को देखेंगे जी जब हम टीवी सीरियल को देखते हैं हम तो ऐसा देखते हैं ओके ये तो हो जाएगा ये नहीं बट दे आर मोर इमोशनल राइट पानी का जल तत्व इज वेरी पावरफुल क्वालिटी of the chart the result it produces yes it is tougher to decide simply on the basis of a single placement itself anyhow it was very nice talking with you yes, i yes, have some yes. other some okay. other day we'll yes talk. yes anna definitely thank you so much thank you so much anna we'll uh, have you again and thank you guys for uh, watching namaste again very very thanks ha uh, thanks namaste namaste namaste